Hey everybody, welcome to another video, and in this one we're going to be going over the December content for Assassin's Creed Origins. So basically everything coming in December that's going to be in the game. So we're just going to get straight into this. So first of all, and probably the most interesting of everything here, is that there will be a Nightmare Mode, which is a new difficulty level that will be available. The enemies will become more resilient to damage and more dangerous. So basically, like a super hard mode, obviously they've gone with Nightmare Mode. I would shift into my opinion on their overpriced gear packs right here because of the word Nightmare, but there's actually an opportunity to do that later. Another thing that will be added will be enemy scaling. By popular request, they're going to add an option to scale enemies levels, which, when activated, will automatically scale the lower level enemies to your level, which I think would be really good. I reckon I'd use that just keeps you on your feet and adds to that fun element of the game. Because in a lot of games, once you reach max level, you're super powerful and nothing seems challenging anymore and that can get very boring very quickly. So I feel as if this is a very important addition as it will make the game more fun for longer. Another thing that will happen is Nightmare and First Civ pack items will be available in the Hecker chests, which is good I do suppose, but then again I'm not best pleased with how they've handled the Nightmare and First Civ pack so far, a removing them from the season pass and b overpricing them to no end. There will also be two new quests released in December, one of which is a new surprise quest that we know nothing of and they're not going to tell us of until it gets released obviously, and the other one is a new quest introducing Horde Mode. This is an event sort of quest, and basically it'll introduce you to the Horde mode to satisfy your warrior longings, as it says. You can prove yourself in the Cyrene Arena against unlimited waves of foes. We recommend level 32 or higher. So I'm level 40, that'll be fun. It sounds like it'll make for a good stream, so keep your eyes open for that one. As for Trials of the Gods, this month players will have a chance to fight the last god of the god trio, the warrior goddess herself, Sekhmet. Are you ready to face the fiercest hunter known to ancient Egyptians? So obviously this is a third trial of the god, basically we'll be fighting Sekhmet, I reckon it won't be too dissimilar from the two fights we've already had, we'll fight off their waves of ground enemies, we'll avoid their attacks and we'll shoot at their heart. And as a reward for doing this we will get a piece of gear upon defeating the god. That'll also make for a fun stream at some point and a fun video, so keep your eyes open for that as well. It also says that it does not end there. In November, many of us proved worthy when we beat Anubis and Sobek in the first two Trials of the Gods, and that they know everybody did not get the chance to face these gods, but now all three gods will be available to fight. So if you didn't manage to face Sobek or Anubis, you can alongside facing Sekhmet and then you can get that gear or whatever. As for the increasingly annoying in-game store, we have two gear packs coming. One is the Gladiator pack, which includes the Spaniard's armor, the Palladium shield, Hercules' Gladius sword, uh, what the hell are these words? Labry's heavy blade and Neptune's grasp. The other pack will probably be very similar to the first Civilization pack and not include an outfit, so there's no image and doesn't say what's in it, but it is called the Wacky Items pack, which will include a mount and four weapons. And both of these packs will be overpriced to no end. But I won't drone on about that, if that happens I'll rant about that separately when it does and for the time being I'll give Ubisoft the benefit of the doubt. But anyway guys, thank you all for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed, be sure to let me know what you think of this content down in the comment section, be sure to go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, share, comment and I'll see you all very soon with another video at some point.